library 24 7. Um, go to your student menu, click on BSD library resources, um, pick your school. I'm going to pick a middle school just because I can. Um, and the first one is Cedar Park, so we're going to go to Cedar Park and borrow ebooks. This is how you can access Sora through the internet. You can also download the app onto another device and access it that way. Um, from the online view, you can see what's available. Um, you can search by popular subjects. So if you know you only want to read historical fiction, you can go in and choose books this way. Whenever you see this blue borrow, that means it's available and that you can borrow immediately. You can also, if you know exactly what you want, you can click on this magnifying glass in the corner and type in the book that you want. Again, this one is not available. This audio version is not available. I know it's audio because I see it's headphones. But this one is available, so I'm going to click on Borrow. And it's going to open up the book. Um, because I've looked at it before, it remembers where I left off, so it's showing the end of the book. Sorry. Okay, it's up. If you were opening it up for the first time, you could click through. Cheese touch! And you could read your book a page at a time. You can stop at any time um, and bookmark your choice. You can skip ahead by using this dial on the bottom, which is what I've done before. And now I've come to the end of the book. I've finished the book, best book I ever read. But now I'm going to close it. And I'm going to return it so the next person can read it. And I'm going to return it by going here to my shelf. This is for me with my own login, and you can see there it is. I can open it back up again, or I can look at other options. I can renew it if nobody else has it on hold, or I can return it, and I would like to return it because I am finished and I want somebody else to get a chance to read all about the cheese touch. So now it shows my shelf. I don't have any books checked out. I go to holds, I can see I have one hold available. Go with the flow. Um, I can see where I am on the wait list. It's really depressing. I need to wait nine weeks because I'm 16th in line. A lot of people wanting to read this one too. That's okay. Um, and I can look at my activity. You can see that I've been checking out Diary of a Wimpy Kid. Um, I can look at a wish list if I so desire. Um, when I'm in my holds list and something is available to me, Sora will alert me, but only when I'm in the app. I won't see that anywhere else. Um, another way to explore is to go down here to your binoculars, the Explore. And if you're clicking on the main page, you'll see this button over here which says Collections. Your district librarians have created a few lists that might um, make you happy. You can um, check out novels in verse. You can check out um, new award winners. Um, award winners are the ones that have been nominated by um, the American Library Association, like the Newbury or the Caldecott. These are all in one place for you. Um, you can see next year's Old Bob list. For elementary and middle, you can see the project lit lists. You can also see a list that we've created for books that have just come into the library. So you can see what's new. Wink just arrived today on March 31st. So you could borrow Wink if you were really smart because it's a great book. And if you don't see anything that you want to check out or there's lots of holes on the things that you want, you can increase your collection by adding your Washington County library card to Sora. You can click on this hamburger menu over here, 
at a public library. I'm just going to type in Beaverton. And I see um, Washington County Library Services. It says Beaverton Murray Shoals. I'm going to say that's my library. And now I have access to Washington County Cooperative Library Services. I don't know if it already knows who I am because I'm logged into my computer. You may be asked to put in your library card number. If you have a YAC card that you just received from the library this year, the blue YAC card, you'll type in BSD and your student number and that will give you access to Washington County's um, library collection as well. So even more opportunities even more stuff that's available to you on your Washington County Library website because they access um, ebooks in the same way that we do. So there's some new ways to search. Happy reading!